Okay angels, so I'm going to quickly talk to you about the Plum Tree app, which you can find through Google or Google Chrome or whatever search engine you find. You can just type in the Plum Tree app dot com and you'll get this where you can create your family trees. This is the Hall and the Kaleo family tree here. Now this is a 10th generation tree right here. And then you can also link trees, which is what I've done here for the Kalahara Legacy family tree. Because I wanted to, I didn't want it, the plum tree app to start lagging basically. So I've made an extension onto the family tree right here. Um, so, and then I'm going to show you the other tree I use which is the quick family tree which is a uh, app on the play store that you can use completely free um, so these are the two that I use at the moment so I'm just gonna run through the family tree on this today just to show you because I've never showed you this one before I've showed you the plum tree app before so so in this, in the hall and the Kalo, Kalo, Ha, I always say that name wrong, bear with me, we started with Eleanor. Eleanor married Jax Vivriel. She had uh, three kids with Jax. However, Kyra was not actually born um, before Jax passed away. She was born the day after Jax passed away. Eleanor then married Leah for um, the money thing that they... Oops, I didn't do that. The money situation. I think I spelled Leah's last name right. I don't know. The really good thing about this is right now you can see all of the children. But you can click on child and spouse. And now you can see who they were married to. So Oliver was married to Zena, Helene, Hermans. So it's them two there. And Timothy was married to Blair Away. And Kyra was married to Elma Harper. And then if you click on the next bit, you can see their children. So in this case, Oliver and Zena had Marissa, Vivian, Miranda, Venkat, and Michelle. Timothy and Blair had Joelle, Karina, Bo, Megan, and Kyra, and Elma had Eve, Levi, and Eden. So right now I'm going to use Eve as the main thing. I'm going to switch back to just child so you can see from here. So Eve was the oldest. So Eve married. Eve was in a polyamorous relationship with Corinne and Alyssa. Um, she was actually officially married to Corinne until Corinne died as an elder. And then when they were elders, she got married to Alyssa. But she had one child with both of them. So with Corinne, she had Victor. With Alyssa, she had Sasha. Levi married Michaela Branch. And they had Lorraine. Garrett and Cullen were twins, and then they had Elena. Uh, and then Eden married Mason, Winter, and they had Alyssa, Matilda, and Haley. Now, Elena does come back in the tree later, and I'll show you when she does. So, yeah. So, the heir was Sasha. So, I'm just going to quickly show you here. So, so Victor was the oldest, however, this was a, uh, a matriarchy at the time, so Victor may have been the oldest, however, obviously, being a matriarchy meant that Sasha Bella took over. So, Victor married Sydney Hastings, and they had Tana and Herbert together. Sasha married Theodore. 
um, Skelton and then again Voss because Theo could not stand Sasha Bella's dream of running a farm. I know Sasha Bella, Sasha's dream of running a farm. And he felt like it got in the way of his athletic career. So he dumped her. But she was pregnant with Luna at the time. She already had Bill. So them two had Bill and Luna together. Theo then got remarried to Elena. And they had Kay Branch. So uh, then Sasha remarried to Jamal and had April. So the children. We'll do children's. No, I said that wrong. Okay. <laughs> I'm still learning. So we will click on Luna and that will bring up. So we'll look at Bill first because Bill is the oldest. So from Bill, Bill married Amaya Briscoe and had Abdullah and Eliza. Uh, right, I'm going to go back on here because I want to show April. So April married, because April's tree doesn't go any further than this. So April married Chris Dorset and had Corey and Liberty. And then Luna was a serial romantic. Uh, did Kai marry? Hang on. I don't remember that. I have to check that one. Oop, I didn't mean to do that. Yes, Kai did marry. See, I almost forgot then. Kai married Bo Broke and had Gem and Thalia branch. There you go. So, let's go back. So, yeah, Luna was a real man, a serial romantic sim. She dated many people, but she only had one child, and that was Maple with Hayden Yamaguchi. Um, the way that Hayden came to be is Hayden was curated by, how do I create him now? I grabbed two sims off the gallery and I mixed their DNA and basically that's how Hayden was made. So, yeah. So, uh, Luna and Hayden had Maple, Maple married Bella... And they had six children. I'm actually just going to show you the six children from here. So they had Phoenix, River, Arizona, Oceana, Paris, and Bedelia. Um, so, yeah. And they all went on to have kids themselves. So Phoenix married Javon McKee. Javon was not faithful to Phoenix at all. He had two... Um, uh, flings so he had a fling with Erica Sims and had Hugh and he had a fling with Life Liverpool and had Roll. Hugh and Roll are younger than both their actual kids so they had hang on I'll go at one bring the tree back to here uh, they they only had Derek and Winter. Winter became the heir. Derek uh, got married to Lana Lai and had triplets. London, Rita and Omari. And then went, later on had a single child, Jeanette. So, yeah. Right. Um... The next one was River. River married Greta Stein and had Zara, Maura, Alaya, Jaslyn, August. There is some extra tree on Zara and some of the fir- some of the first for- uh, born girls in the cousins, and I will explain that later. Uh, Arizona married Colleen Little and had Megan, Regan, Hannah, Bradley. Seth, um, Oceana married Seth, Lyndon, and they had Richard, Leela, Mackay, Nicholas, and Hannah. I have my book next to me so I can tell exactly who they married, so just bear me. Paris married Tommy O'Connor and had Hannah. I did not name any of my 
any of the spare kids. So this is why there's two Hannahs. I would never have actually done that. Even though they're spelled slightly differently. But I still want to have done that. So Hannah, Evangeline, Adriana, Skylar, Kristen and Lillian. And don't mind my cat. She's just talking at the moment. Uh, we had Bedelia, Mary, Marilyn Gates. Marilyn Gates is a sim off the gallery. Most of the sims that my, uh, my sims married were from the gallery. So we have Alyssa Hall, Magdalena Hall, Salvatore Hall, Jenna Hall, Luna and Isaac. Uh, Skylar and Kristen are twins. Uh, Luna and Isaac are twins. Was there any others? Not in this generation. Right, so to explain that situation, I had to click on Winter. So Winter married... No, sorry. Winter was dating Jordan while she was with... Uh, when she was with Jordan, because they were dating throughout uh, high school... When they became young adults, Winter soon fell pregnant with Sasha Bella. While she was pregnant with Sasha Bella, basically Jordan hates children completely. It drives, you know, he absolutely hates children. He doesn't want to know. So, he split up from Winter. He married Zara. Zara then found out she was pregnant with Noel. And then he, div- uh, hang on. No, he was treating Winter really bad when they were still dating while she was pregnant. So Winter dumped him and that's why they split up. Then he got married to Zara. Um, He broke up with Zara. So he wouldn't get hurt from the breakup. You know, he got hurt from the breakup anyway. But yeah, but Zara had Noel. Um, He dated Megan until until he found out Megan was pregnant with Rain. And then he dumped her. He dated Leela. Until she, he found out she was pregnant and dumped her. He dated Hannah. Until he found out she was pregnant with Christy and then he dumped her. And then he dated Alyssa until she, he found out she was pregnant with Rodrigo. When he aged up to a young adult. Uh, that is when Jordan became a bit more mature. And begged Winter for forgiveness. And... They got back together. At this point, Sasha Bella was a teenager. So, they got back together. They got married very short after. And then Winter found out she was pregnant with Zayn. So, that's how this goes. So, I'm going to click on Sasha Bella. So none of those uh, spare kids actually got married at all. Zayn didn't get married or get with anyone. So let's just let's do a child focus here just so I can make the tree a little bit smaller. So then Sasha Bella married Spencer. They had sing- or four single babies, one after the other. So this is 10th generation right here. So Summer Hall is 10th generation. Summer is the heir of 10th generation. Uh, and then there's autumn, winter, and spring. Spring is actually the only one, if I remember. Because I, I got my game up in front of me. I think spring is the only one that's still technically alive as I'm filming this. I could be wrong. But I'm pretty sure. Uh, nope. Uh, winter and spring are still alive right now in my game so yeah so yeah and from here they married so summer married maxwell davis autumn married charlotte davis yes these two are siblings i've connected them here i can't remember their parents name so i just did it that way um So, yeah. Uh, Winter married Khan Sharp and Spring married Diego, Diego Tom. They went on to have children. Ethan is the only child of Summer and Maxwell. 
and is the heir of the Koloha family because he took his wife's last name and from Ethan it becomes a patriarchy. So, yeah. So, Autumn and Charlotte had Shia, Amy, Carla and Cassidy. Um, Shia is a single child and Amy, Carla and Cassidy are triplets. Um, Khan and Winter, I hope I'm pronouncing that right. I don't know how to pronounce that. If you know how to pronounce that, let me know. Had Roll, again, I wouldn't have named him that because a previous sim was named Roll. Uh, we have Roll, Van and James. I didn't name any of them. Uh, Diego and Spring had Irene and Thomas. So from these two, so Ethan is the current heir. And the way I'm running the, the patriarchy is as soon as they roll the trait, they want to ha uh, they want to a who, then I have to uh, click try for baby instead. And once the next heir reaches young adult, this is what I've decided, then that stops because otherwise I'm not going to have any room for the next heir to have any kids. <laughs> Since the previous generation stays in the family till the day of old age. So, yeah. So, Ethan married Noai. And so far they have five kids. They... My plan for them originally was to have three, but obviously with that, if they roll woohoo, they have to try for baby. They got pregnant twice from that, so yeah. So Koa is the next heir. So Koa, Kolo, Kolo, Koloha. And then they had Moana, Ocean, Ariel, and Shell. So Ariel was the first, she has literally just aged up to a teen. There is a almost a week between her and her siblings and then of course Shell Shell wasn't Ariel and Shell were the ones that were not planned for and god <laughs> Shell is driving me insane because I'm trying to get the, these lot relationships sorted because so far Koa and Moana have relationships as teens Ocean and Ariel do not and then I'm trying to sort out Shell's toddler skills to make sure she gets happy toddler like the rest of them did. But, yeah. So, yeah, that is my family tree. And to give you an idea of just how big and complicated this tree is, this is mainly Jordan's fault. Because <laughs> he had so many people it messes up. But you can see the family tree like that. So, yeah. Oh, I just prefer to start from here and then do it this way. And then it looks cool. Because I can go from Kyra to Eve to Sasha to Luna to Maple to Phoenix to Winter. Sasha Bella, Summer, Ethan, Koa. But Ko Koa does isn't a young adult yet, so yeah. I don't know which one I find easier yet. I think the Plum Tree app is good if you want to add details and add, add a lot of details. But when your tree does get big enough, it does start to lag. So that's why I linked it to a secondary tree with the Koloha family. So, I'm still going to continue both trees, but I'm just showing you this is what I've done now. So, I have this extra one for adding the members a little better. So, that is everything I wanted to show you, and I hope you stay tuned to see more to do with this family. Um, yeah. Bye. Real quick before I go, I forgot to mention the reason that I use these two trees is because they're tree in game calls sims and when you're a big family you find sims missing quite often so that is why i've decided to do that so i don't know